guys, this is me, Noelia Castillo again. In this opportunity, we're going to try an Italian wine based in Verdicchio grape. Uh, the name of this wine is Villa Taurini uh, from 2016, so it's just last year. Uh, uh, Verdicchio grapes are mainly produced in the Marche area in uh, Italy, central, central Italy. Uh, something to take in count every time we're going to serve a wine is the temperature. So in this case, this wine is medium body, so uh, we can play between 8 to 10 degrees Celsius to serve this wine. It's a fuel cup, so no suffering this time with the course glue. We're going to see how it goes. In nose, actually, it's very light. Uh, you practically need to put your nose inside the cup to really feel the hints of the wine. You can feel the citrus hints, um, the almond hints, and something very particular in this wine is the fennel hints. In Palais, It's a very pungent wine to be white, actually. Uh, you can feel more the bitter almond in the tea, in the palais. The citrus is more intense. So actually what you feel in nose and what you feel in palais, it doesn't really balance together. It has length, yeah, because it remains the flavor of the wine for a certain time in the, in the mouth. It's very intense, but it's not really balanced because uh, what you feel in the nose, quite not the same as in palette. It's more in palette. In this time, we're going to pair it with a lasagna. So, we chose uh, Italian food with Italian wine. And something too much, something that may not fail. So, we see how it goes. Salute! Howdy! Well, as a conclusion of the wine, we already tried it with the lasagna. Actually, Verdicchio base wine is a very easy to drink wine we kind of felt more the bitterness of the wine in palate with comparing it with the food uh, this bitter almond that is very characteristic in verdicchio based wines is see, you feel it more when you pair it with the food uh, not much to say about this actually it's not really balanced as i said so if we have to say or to value this wine from one to five i would give no more than three because it's a very simple wine um so if you just want to like an easy to drink wine to 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 pair with something like italian something like seafood something like even oily because it's fresh it's fresh you really can feel the citrus in the wine it is a very good option for you it's not a very expensive wine so value price with the quality wine it's not so far so enjoy guys I really encourage you to try it. Try different wines, as many as you like. And just don't forget to subscribe in our channel. And to give some ideas, if you would like to see, please don't put Opus One, something <laughs> affordable for everyone. Uh, why not me one day, we can try. But for now, just affordable things, please. Something that you would like to pair with or something you would like to know how to pair with, just feel free to write and subscribe to our channel to see more videos about wine and food. Bye-bye!